Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Crimson Raven, and welcome back to Darkest Dungeon. Today, we have a bunch of new people with us. Um, I did get go out and recruit, because we were able to get a stagecoach upgrade in the hero barracks. And we got three new people with us. We got Pyro, the grave robber, who is going to be very, very, very good for us, because he can crit to the moon. This man brings the damage. And he has a stun when he fades. And I could even make him lunge forward quite a bit, but that is not my plan here. The flashing daggers also induce bleed resist, which is going to be very, very, very good for us, because today we're going to the Warrens, and bleed is key. We want to bring all of the bleeds. So Bleed Resist down on enemies is going to be very good to set up for uh, his partners. We also have Gay the Houndmaster, who is not going to be part of this quest today, but he's still in. He's got his doggy. Let's hope that it goes better for him than it went for Ultimate Dude, our only casualty. And we have Apotheo. Yet another Vestal. I thought that having a second healer after Snugs would be really useful. We actually do have one. We have King. Um, but King's been missing for a while. He's finally back. And King has a mark, which is going to set up the Throne Dagger for Pyro. Because it does an extra 25% damage versus Marked. He also has this thing which will enhance his stun with the fade, with the shadow fade. And it gives him extra dodge every time he stuns someone. So usually it's a pretty good plan to go for the stun and as well, you know, base damage. So that is it for the new arrivals. We're going to the Warrens today. Look at our team. Front to back, we got King here, the occultist with his hex and his healing and his pole that clears out the corpses it can be very very good very useful so i'm counting on moving people around with him and marking them for these two to stab away we got captain jack the jester who brings in all of the bleeds he brings in all of the bleeding is going to be really good because especially yeah he has a speed of six he has a speed of six just kind of slow but it means that pyro is going to go before him every time so if i flashing daggers and then harvest that is going to be a lot of bleeding it's going to be a lot of bleeding. Or I can stun someone and then Jack can just stab them or slice them off. Has a fairly high chance to crit on most abilities. And uh, the finale is just magnificent. So I'll freaking love it. We got Pyro in the second rank, as I just explained. And Alpha Centauri is back. Because he's a Warren Scrounger and a very good tank. So I thought I'd bring him in and it's going to be just fine. It's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. Let's provision. Okay. So, two full meals. Eight torches. Let's put that down to six. I don't have a lot of money right now, so... I'm going to need... We already have two medicinal herbs, which is going to be very, very useful for us. Three bandages, one key. Uh, the three bandages is because King's, King's healing might cause bleeding on ourselves. And I don't really have any other way to get rid of the bleeding... Uh, other than heal through it, and that that is a, a, a you know it's heal zero to twelve, so it's a quite a gamble. It's quite a wide range. So three bandages, a key. Uh, I'm gonna bring in a second shovel. I'm 
I'm actually going to bring an extra two food for healing in between meals like I did in the last episode. We got lucky last time. Let's try to hedge our bets a little bit more. Let's go to the Warrens. They breed We're in. We're getting scouting right dark. away. Oh, that is perhaps nice. Perhaps we can slay them even faster. Okay, we got to go for room battles. So we could go straight down and get two fights. Or go around, take a bit of stress damage from being in here so long. And go for this curio. Hmm. How confident am I? There's two curios down that way too. Should probably go for that. Yeah, alright, let's go down. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. D3 do a lot of damage. Crashing daggers for 4 and 5. As well as a debuff. Look where it hurts. 4 damage. Look where it hurts again. For 7 damage. Ow. That is not fun. Harvest these two. Let's bleed them. And uh, word regress. Let, let's kill them up. Seven for the heals, but we're we're bleeding. That's fine. That is fine. Hugh, these two. One of them's dead. Maintain. And the other two are probably dead on their turn. Yes. Feels good, man. I like that. I can flashing daggers. Disadvantage. Give them no quarter. Got an extra shovel. As victories mount. That is nice. So too will resistance. I got a barrel here. Uh, should I cinch that up? Yes. I'm going to do that right now. I have brought a bunch of bandages for a reason. Okay. Moonshine barrel. A barrel that reeks of powerful liquors. I'm thinking medicinal herbs here? Yeah. Oh, ho, 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 ho. plus 30 damage until camp. This is a short quest, so we're not going to camp. 30% damage for Pyro. He's going to hit like a truck. Crate is empty. Moving on to the next room where we have a fight and a curio. Torching it up. Surprised. Let's do this. Okay. That small bastard here causes a lot of disease. That bastard here causes a lot of bleeding. The bastard at the back causes a butt ton of stress. If I go Abyssal Artillery on both of, them, both of these two at the back. Yeah, let's start with that. Let's damage them a, 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 a good bit here. And I think... Yeah, I'm going to fade. I'm going to fade and prevent this guy from bleeding us. He's stunned. And I'm buffed. Which is even better. Harvest. Bleed both of them. That is good. I can shot this guy. For 9 damage. So he's dead on his turn. That is very nice. Okay. Jack is marked, so that's going to be a problem. Vomit, miss, or not. To a Crit. Blow. Oh, that's a lot of stress. I don't like that. Butcher Scott. Bit of bleeding here, but we'll be fine. Gently. This is how a life is taken. Two damage per turn. Okay. So if I flashing dagger, he's definitely dead on his turn. But I'm not sure that's what I want to do. I might want to just murder this guy outright. 6 to 12. I have a half... To, that 6 to 12. That's also 6 to 12. Got a mark. Okay, no. Let's flashing daggers because this guy is, is a pain in the ass. Flashing daggers. And then we can bleed Destroy this swine in the back. Them all. Let's slice him off. There we go. Four damage and he's dead on his turn. Good. 
Ball and chain. Ow. I'm getting stunned here. It's kind of bad. But we're okay. Heal up the pyro. Nine heal. Oh, man, that feels good. That feels really nice. I could intimidate him. If I intimidate him, it's going to lower his damage. Uh, or unless he resists the debuff. That's bad. That is bad. Okay, stab. Stab forward. Like that. Mark it. I'm pretty sure I can throw... Butcher Cut out. That's another bleed. I'm gonna cinch that up. Uh, there we go. Bandages. We're fine. We're fine. Chop him. Nine damage. And Pyro's going in. Oh, he can't. Okay. I gotta move him back. Heal up Centauri for one. He's bleeding. Fuck. Why finale? Uh, I can just stab him. Four. Ball and chain. I should have finaled. I should have killed him outright. Centauri gets to go though. So. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Nice. And we're we're gonna get some food. That is even better. Okay, uh, Jack, you're going back here. Who should I give this to? I'm gonna give it to give it to Jack. It might give him. I don't know if it gives any stress relief, but I'm hoping for it. Well, ten food. Oh, that's nice. Awarded to the brave and the That is very alike. nice. So Centauri can just fill up. It's just two damage. I can I can live with that. I'll be fine. Okay, there's a bunch of traps. Usually... No, get... Get back there. Usually, I think Jack is pretty good with traps, so that could be uh, in our favor. Heirlooms? Might as well. How good is he? 70, 90, 50, 50. So at 70, I could take the chance... Oh, yeah. Yep. I did take the chance, and I think it was worth it just for the stress relief. Torch, as we go in, we know there's no fight in this room. We're good. Let's move up. Let us move up. What's in the bag? Loot. More food. Can you eat? Okay, Centauri's full. Jack can eat. Let's give him two food. Fill him up a bit. Give two to King as well. Might as well. Might as well use the advantage here. Should I go again? Yes. Disarmed. An extra eight stress relief. Into another room that has nothing. Moving on. Pile of bones. Fuck. That's bad. Jack, you should not have... Oh, loot. Usually that's bad. I'm happy it turned out right. It turned out pretty good. What's in the bag? More loot. More food. Sure. Eat up. Yeah, Centauri's still full. He's the one I really want to... All right, there we go. Still have 11 food. Let's get into this fight. Okay. That is not a setup that I like. At all. I'm gonna slice off this guy because I want him to die as quick as possible. Three damage per round. He's almost dead already. So flashing daggers will kill him. And a good debuff on that. Yes. 
Uh, I'm gonna go Abyssal Artillery. Crit! Quakes. Oh, King, I love you right now. Dodges the Butcher Cut. That is really good. And uh, we can purge. Knock that fucker back. Clear the corpses. He resisted the move, though. It's kind of bad. Slice off the piggy. Yes. Oh, the crit and the stress relief with the crit. That's even better. Stun the big dude. And chop him. For 14. Holy shit, Centauri's doing work. Hex him. Let's go. He's stunned and everything. Why am I not able to throw a dagger right now? Why am I... Oh, because he's, he's in the front. That's why. Oops. Pick to the face. A thousand gold and a this key. This expedition at least promises success. All right. Uh, hidden compartment. Packs laden with a bunch loot. of heirlooms. Are often this is very nice. Supplies. And we get some scouting too. Yes. Okay, so we got two more fights. We got two more fights and a curio. So far we're looking good. So I'm happy with that. Can I give some food to Centauri? Yes, I can. Fill him up. We still have two full meals. Torch it up. Is lit. Let's go. The, path is clear. We require the collector. The to it. Well then, that's bad. That is very bad. <laughs> Ah, shit, I forgot to move. I forgot to move Pyro back into his place. Mark him. Because he's going to be summoning a bunch of things. Collect call. Like that. So he's moving back, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep throwing daggers at him. Is what I'm hoping for here. I could... Yeah, they, these things can't bleed. Actually, they do have... A fair amount of bleeding. Let's harvest... Great! Under fire. That is nice. Very nice. Yet yeah, let's hew at the front. They dodged. And the throwing dagger. Seven. Hmm. What can I do here? Abyssal artillery. Yes. Let's keep damaging the big guy. Head games. So he's getting guarded. Guarded by collected man at arms. Okay, that's fine. I can harvest both of them. Head hunt. Stab. And we're bleeding. That's bad. Life steal. Oh, that's bad. That's very bad. Oh shit, that's bad. Okay. Uh kill them. Just just kill it. Head on again. Captain Jack just dodged it. We have bandages, so next time King goes. Next time King goes, he, he's, he's getting a bandage. Cinch it up. Oh, I should have healed myself first. I can't do that anyway. Healing for three. Resisted the bled. So that's good. Ooh. Oh, I don't like this. That's a lot of stress. I am not enjoying this right now. Flashing daggers. Uh, why did not not do the flashing daggers? That's bad. Slice him off. Bleed him. Just bleed him. Uh, heal two. There we go. Mark him again. We gotta keep on the damage. We gotta keep on the damage. Throw him back here for 13. And slice him off. Stack on the bleeding. Six damage for three rounds. That's 18. That's a stress attack again. Please don't freak out. 
Okay, he resisted the bleeding. That's really the only thing that matters to me right now. Phew. Collect call. So he's summoning more people. But he's bleeding quite badly. Uh, I'm gonna harvest and kill both of them and ideally bleed the other one. Artillery. Six damage. He's almost dead. Is he dead on his turn? Yes! He's dead on his turn! That is great. So I could just throw the dagger at this guy instead. For nine. And then I can hew. And then they dodged. So, gotta fuck me. Let's, let's kill this guy. Okay. Because the big one's dead on his turn. We know that. We know that. We just know it. Uh, stab. Just, just stab. That's good. He passes. That's even better. That gives us some time to try to heal up. Let's heal up some time. For eight. He bleeds, but we're fine. That's a nine damage incoming. It's not that hard. That's a lot of gold, though. Remind yourself. Oh, I like a that. Slow and insidious killer. We're already out of bandages. That's kind of that is really bad. But I'm yeah. It is the last fight, so I'm gonna be eating all of the food before we go in. What's in the bag? Extra if food. Treasure could staunch the flow well then. Otherworldly corruption. Like that. Eat, 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 eat. Everybody just eat. Okay. I feel a little bit better now. Torch it up. Light, Last torch. The promise of safety. Let's go. Drums of debilitation. These little fuckers, the carrion eaters, are very, 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 very annoying. Flashing daggers. And these two for five each. Then I'm gonna harvest them for three each and some bleeding. So they're dead. The slow death. Good. Unforeseen. Good. Alright. Looking good, looking good. Mark. Should I even mark? Or just heal? Heal yourself. For three. Resisted the bleeding. That's good. Shot the small one. Shit. Missed. Munch. Dodged it! Holy shit! Pyro, you're a beast! Stab the big one. That's good. You're fine. Drums of Doom. That's a stress attack, which is why I try to... Oh! That is nice. That is very, very nice. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Heal yourself again for five. Uh, uh slice them off. Just kill him. Crit. Oh, the stress relief. Munch for three. And life, but he resisted. Let's chop him. Let's just, just kill him. Cleansed Just frickin' lands. kill him. Okay, quest complete. Yes. I think we can... Can we afford to continue adventuring? There might be a hunger event in that corridor in this just one curio. Forget it. I'm out of here. That is good, because we brought some in a bunch of level zero, so I was really happened. hoping to get some, some good experience here. We got an extra dazzling charm. It's going to be useful. A pretty good haul overall. We got over 10k. And a decent amount of heirlooms. I'm happy. I'm pretty happy. What do we got here? Alpha moves up to level one. And gets Ligophobia. So he's scared of the dark. And he's a clutch hitter. Yes. Pyro gets to level one too. He doesn't gain any traits. Captain Jack gets to level one with Eldritch Slayer. Crit damage on Captain Jack. That's always nice. Ruminator four. King minus 10 stress healed. That's kind of bad. 
but I think I can live with it. Anyways, that's it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, make sure to like, share, and subscribe, as well as leave your feedback in the comments down below. As for me, I'm Crimson Raven. I'll see you soon.